Good morning, friends. Thought I better say a quick good morning. We have the grandkids today, so I don't know how much I'll be able to record. But Jerry has gone to go meet them um, at Mooville to pick them up. So I am just finishing my first cup of coffee. It's always black. And I have got to go take a shower before they get here in about 15 minutes. So it's supposed to have a chance of rain today. Um, it is 59 degrees out. It's supposed to be like, I think, 77, 78 today. So, but yeah, I'm tired. Haven't had breakfast yet. So... I got on the scales this morning and I was up another half pound. So, I don't know. Gotta get my act together, I, I guess. Try to figure out this uh, snacking at night time. So, I need to learn to go back and just snack on vegetables and uh, fruit. And if I sound tired, I am tired. Didn't sleep well last night. Well, I slept good until 2 a.m. And then Miss Callie slept at my feet, kept waking me up. Then she'd get up and go up by Jerry. <sighs> Didn't ya? Didn't you? So I slept hard until 2, and then I woke up about 3, and then 5.30, and... Then the alarm went off at 7.30, so. But anyways, I hope that your um, Tuesday uh, was a great one. And congratulations to the ones who have um, lost this week. So stinking proud of you. You motivate me to keep trying. And um, for the ones who are struggling, stay strong, my friends. I understand we got this. We can struggle, but we can't give up, okay? We're going to come back stronger. So anyways, I will chit-chat with you all later. Thanks again, my friends. friends happy Tuesday July 2nd so um Jerry took the grandkids into town <clears throat> and um, that gave me a hot minute to um, be here they wanted to go in his Mustang uh, and he put the top down and they took off and that they're just having the time of their life and I could have went, but sometimes it's nice that both grandkids get him by himself too, so, because they're usually with me. But so far this morning, um, Riker and Peepaw, as they call him, has been out into his woodworking area and they are making a suet. Um, they're making two of them and Peepaw's doing one and Riker's making his own. And, um... So they had to run in and get some more special screws for that. And um, I needed more um, regular flour. And I think once they get back with the regular flour, I think Layla and I will um, maybe do some cinnamon rolls that will go home with them. I'll keep a couple here, but the majority of them will go home with them. <clears throat> and then Layla's been in the house with me, and she's just been chit-chatting right along. And um, I've been sitting here knitting on my socks and um, watching Bluey with her. And just having that one-on-one -on -one with her, and he, he's having the one-on-one -on -one with Riker. <clears throat> and then she went out to do her um, diamond dot at the table. So um, she was doing that, and then... Um, Jerry came in and said he had to run into town, so he had four places to stop, and so um, he asked them if they, he want, if they wanted to take the Mustang. Of course, they got very excited over that, and um, yeah, 
So they're gone in town. I told them that um, to remind people that they're allowed to pick up their um, a favorite Gatorade drink that they like, and they can each have a um, a sweet of something or a bag of chips or something like that. So I just thought I'd come on and just say, hey, um, oh my goodness, I'm tired. Like I said earlier this morning, my head isn't the greatest, but <clears throat> allergy season and pollen is very, very high right now. But I just wanted to flip the camera and show you where I am on my July socks. Um, I have not worked on the um, blanket yet. And, um, yeah, I've just been knitting on these socks. It's an easy thing to, I don't have to concentrate <laughs> with the grandkids here. Oh, and the other thing is, is my smoothie this morning is going to end up being eight points because the homemade yogurt is three points um, per half cup. I know that's high, but, I, you know, it's something I'm just trying. And the next time... Well, not the next time, but the next time after, I will get the 2% and try it with that and see if I get as much. But anyways, it was the homemade yogurt and um, the frozen fruit, the banana, and the one cup of milk. <clears throat> and I know I could cut that back. If I cut back the, the milk, I could probably cut that down to half a cup. So, and I might try that too. But anyways, not for sure what lunch is going to be today or supper. Never know on days like this today. So um, let me show you where I am at um, the socks. So as you can tell, it's kind of been a sunny day. Just starting to come out. It's been cloudy all morning. It is 70 degrees out. Miss Callie is out here with me now. She normally will um, stay out of the picture um, when the grandkids are here, but today she's gotten brave where she's came out here in the sunroom with Layla and myself. Um, so, but anyways, this is where I am on the socks. So they are ready for the heel flap and turn. And each of them, I only did 10 rows of 2x2 two two, um, ribbing, which is knit 2, purl 2. And I only did 20 instead of 30 for the leg. So I just finished the second one. So I'll go back to the first one. And I will start on the um, heel flap and turn. But this is how this is knitting up. And these will be a gift pair of socks. So, anyways, while they're gone, I thought I would hop on and just say, hey, a quick minute. And um, just see what this afternoon will bring. Um... I hope that you are all doing well. Um, I am thankful that the weight gain was only half a pound and not much more, but I definitely, and it's not like I haven't been doing my back to basics. I still am weighing and measuring. It's just that um, snacky stuff at night. Um, instead of having like fruits and vegetables or a protein, I am reaching for the pretzels or the skinny cow ice cream, you know, stuff like that. So, but it's a new week, new set of points. I'm going to do my darndest with a um, holiday in here. And with the grandkids today, I'm going to do my darndest to stay on track. And um, if I go a little off, that's all right because I'm living life with my grands. And I, you know, don't get that chance as often as I would like. <sighs> yeah, because they're growing up too fast. So, all right. Thanks again, my friends. See you later. Hey, friends. Um, I'm going to be closing out the video. 
but we have one special thing we have to do and <laughs> Jerry's next to me so go ahead happy anniversary happy anniversary to Sandy and Jim 53 years I think she said Wow yeah. to the same person too I know Congratulations. Congratulations. I hope that your day was a great and blessed one and you enjoyed every bit of it with him. Talk to you later. Ready? Yep. Happy anniversary. Happy anniversary. Happy anniversary. Happy anniversary. Happy, 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 happy anniversary. Happy, 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 happy anniversary. Happy. You make it look easy. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna choke on my own spit. Oh, happy anniversary again, my friend. Love you.